So I'm going to break down some of the songs that are in Whole Lot of Red from Playboy Cardi and show you exactly how they were made. Then afterwards, we're going to take those same tips into our own beat. Let's go ahead and jump into it. So first, let's go ahead and start it off with the song New Neon from Playboy Cardi. Dope song. Also, in the comments, let me know which one of your songs was your favorite. Here's the first one that we use, and here's the sounds that I use. It was in a B minor scale at 130 tempo. And uh, let's go ahead and close that out. And you can see here, this was some of the sounds one of the plugs that I use. Let's listen to it real quick. This next one was from Nexus. I feel like this one was really close to how it actually sounded in the song. You can see this is what I use right here in Nexus and let's listen to it real quick. Basically, this whole beat is just layering a bunch of sounds that pretty much just sounded good. So the next sound that I used was just a little xylophone, you know what I'm saying? Just because I wanted to really sound like the song that was in the album. And the last one was a steel drum. I felt like with that mixed in there, with the rest of the sounds, I felt like it sounded exactly or close enough to the actual song. And that's pretty much it. So next is the drums. So with the 808, it was a simple pattern, nothing crazy. Let's hear it real quick. Next was the hi-hat. It's super simple, you know what I'm saying? Very repetitive. It wasn't hard at all, so let's listen to it real quick. And this little bit snare portion in there that sounded pretty good. Let's listen to it. So with all that together, the whole beat sounds like this. So I felt like that really sounded like the song New Neon from Playboy Cardi, Whole Lot of Red. So next, we're gonna jump into the next song that a lot of people like from the album, which is Sky. A lot of people like that song. I like that song myself. The whole thing just sounded great to me. So we're just gonna go ahead and start off with the keys. And that one was another one I felt like too. It was just su super simple, super easy to do. Mainly, I just have literally like two different instruments here. And then here's one of the lead, the sounds that I use. This one right here. The second one that I paired with it was a sound from Massive. The whole thing sounded pretty good. Good. Here we go right here, bass model. And then on the, the channel, I added just a little flanger in there, you know, so just add a little effect. But let's listen to these real quick. <laughs> So I felt like that sounded really good. It sounded just like it. So after that, that was that's pretty much it right there in the melody. You know what I'm saying? So now the next part is the drums. Super easy. Let's jump into it. So let's go ahead and jump into the 808. Here's the 808 here. Simple pattern. Let's listen to it. Simple pattern, you know what I'm saying? And then they added a kick in there as well in some parts, so let's listen to it. And that was it on the kick part, and then the next part will be the hi-hat. That was super easy too as well, let's listen to it. And then they added a few little snare bounces in there. Along with the like a rim shot kind of sound. And with all that together, the whole beat sounds like this. So that's 
literally one of the most popular two songs out of that whole album. So now what we're gonna do is basically take those same methods that they use, those simple patterns that they use, some of the retro sounds that they use, simple beat patterns and structures that they use into our own beats to see what we come up with. So I got a super simple one here, uh, two sounds in there, nothing crazy. Uh, one of them was an Electra and it's called Micro Chord, super easy. Love the way how it sounded. It felt like some Cardi B type, my bad. <laughs> I say Cardi B, Playboy Cardi type vibes, my bad. I don't know why I keep mixing the two names. Next is another sound called Flapper. And with both of these sounds together, they sound like this. Okay, so nothing crazy, you know what I'm saying? It's super simple, but on some Playboy party type vibe, you know what I mean? So next, we're just gonna go ahead and move on to the drums. So I got a simple pattern here for the 808, nothing crazy, but let's just go ahead and listen to it. So that's literally the 808 right there. And now we have the hi-hat. So let's listen to it real quick. Like I said, this one is easy, easy pattern. You can really do on your own. It's not that hard. Just a few little rolls here and there, and then boom. Next was the clap, and then I added a few little snares in there just to complement the bounce a little bit. And with all that together, this beat sounds like this. That was a super simple Playboy Cardi type beat. And now we're gonna make one more beat just to show you and prove to you that you don't need a million sounds in there, especially when you're making like a Playboy Cardi type song or beat. So with this next one, I pretty much layered a bunch of different sounds that kind of give me that retro feeling or vibe or whatever, you know what I'm saying? I got it in D minor and it's at tempo 140. So here's one of the sounds right here, Super Pluck. Another one of the sounds right here, Hybrid DSP. And another one of the sounds is from Electra. When you want Playboy Cardi type sounds, this is where you go to electric and with all those put together they sound like this and also on the uh, master channel for that for the melodies i got this little effect on there effect tricks and you know what i'm saying just some simple little edits you know what i mean just to give it some more bounce too so next i have this one little sound in here that's just going on when the hook plays and this sound is from the scott storage plugin just a little melody rhythm pattern just to you know give it some more bounce let's listen to it real quick So there you go with the melodies. Next will be the drums. So let's go ahead and start off with the 808. So with the 808, I just did a simple pattern, nothing too over repetitive, but just super simple. So let's, let's hear it. I also added in a kick in there as well. Same thing with the hi-hat. I didn't overthink it. I just did a few rolls in there and created a bounce. I added in a clap and a snare, you know what I'm saying? Just to give it more bounce. And with everything together, I'll play it at the end of this video. Hopefully this helps you make Playboy Cardi type vibes. Like I said before, let me know what song from Whole Lotta Red was your favorite. Me personally, I feel like uh, one of them was Sky. That, I feel like that was a dope beat, dope song. Control, Neon, there's so many songs on there I feel like that you could replay over and over. So many people are giving hate about it. I, you know what I'm saying? I, I can understand why some songs weren't that great, but I like music, so some of the songs are good to me. But uh, hopefully this helps you. Make sure you guys stay safe. Remember, it's only a matter of time. Peace.